How's it going everybody? Here's your weekly review of Raw and Smackdown week commencing the 3rd of October. Like, subscribe and leave a comment. Thank you very much. Uh, it starts with Judgment Day coming out with Finn basically talking about they're going to face Edge. Well, Finn's going to face Edge in an eye quick match at Extreme Rules um, and seeming very confident going into the match. <coughs> that then leads into a tag team match with AJ and Ray. Versus Finn and Priest, really good match. Go and watch it. Haven't seen it. Finn does pick up the victory after the match. AJ and Rey Mysterio are arguing. AJ actually pushes Rey on the floor, and then uh, <laughs> Judgment Day come down, just beat everybody up. So that's that. Then it's announced on Twitter, and everybody. I just found this out the other day that DC is DC Daniel Cormier, the former light heavyweight champion, former UFC light heavyweight champion, the former UFC heavyweight champion, the dual champion, the champ champ, one of the greatest of all time, only lost to two people in his whole mixed martial arts career, is actually being the ref for the pit fight or the pit cage match or whatever you want to call it, the pit match. Is it the pit fight, pit match versus Seth and Riddle? So then basically backstage we have Bobby Lashley saying uh, he wants to face somebody who's fired up, he has desire in his next title match. While he while saying that, uh, Mustafa Ali pulls up and basically demands a United States Championship match. So that will happen later on in the show. Then we had uh, Sami Zayn and um, Jimmy both sort of joking, talking about some joke that happened in some house or something. Then Jay comes up and he's really with with, with Solo and Jay's really sort of serious and no one laughs anymore, just gets serious. And then walk, they start walking and they run into the Street Profits and then Dawkins calls out so Dawkins calls out, I think, Sammy and Jay, but Solo steps up to take it. So we'll see what happens there. Uh, then we had a match, uh, Bobby Lashley versus Mustafa Ali. Really, actually, really good match. Uh, Ali pushed Lashley quite a lot. Uh, did a soul, so, sun sort of, sun sort of flip on Lashley's arm, but in the end, coming out. Lashley won and then basically Seth, Seth comes and just flattens everybody so it looks like Seth wants a United States Championship title shot which we'll see he might actually win it and then we have Seth talking about uh, the pit fight the fight pit sorry <laughs> I've now got it right the fight pit there's a little preview it looks like it's originated from NXT um, Real basically comes out saying uh, Seth has no experience in the fight pit and then DC basically comes on, on and says He's going to be the special guest referee and he's going to call it right down the middle, so we'll see. Then Miz is obviously still being stalked by Dexter. I'm not sure what's happening there. They should just make the two fight or whatever. Then we had a match, Candice versus Dakota Kai in a really good match. Dakota Kai won. Then backstage, you go back to Miz. Miz has just been laid out by somebody and he has a card on it with uh, Dexter's face. So yeah, we'll see what happens there. Then we had Johnny Gargano uh, versus Otis in a really good match, but Otis won. Uh, by theory hitting uh, Johnny with a briefcase but then Braun then they all start jumping on Johnny and then Braun basically comes down and cleans house then we had Braun versus Gable Braun won obviously then Bobby Lashley's back in, in, in the back getting nursed on his shoulder and then he says to the physician he's basically going to crush Seth so we see what happens there then we have Bailey versus Bianca contract signing it gets a bit heated they have a little back and forth then obviously it breaks into a brawl so we'll see what happens in the pay-per-view. Then we have Do uh, Dawkins versus Solo in a really good match, but Solo one is quite undefeated right now. He's doing his thing. Then Austin Theory says he wants Johnny G. So that should be a good match next week on Raw. Then have a, a cut with uh, interview with Edge. Edge basically saying he's been there. He's been broken. He's been coming back. He's relentless. And he wants all the smoke, literally, with the Judgment Day at uh, Extreme Rules. Then in the main event, we had Alexa Bliss versus EO Sky in a really good match, but EO Sky actually won. And then Alexa, Oscar and Bianca all get into a brawl where it will actually get beat down by, by damage control. So see what happens there. Then we have SmackDown, Triple H comes out, basically says, welcome to Fox. Uh, it's a big premiere on Fox. So it goes off, it starts off with the Tribal Chief coming out, the Bloodline comes out. It's, it's now Roman's 768th day as champion. Before he could even say anything, he says, acknowledge me, but then Logan Paul comes straight out. Uh, they have a back and forth. Then uh, Paul H comes on the mic and basically just undresses <laughs> Logan Paul. And then as things start getting heated, Logan Paul basically says, who's the tribal chief here, Jimmy or Roman? 
Jay or Roman and then Sami Zayn comes in. Sami Zayn is totally over, he gets cheered and basically calms things down. So see what happens there. Then we had Ricochet versus Solo in a match, obviously Solo won. Then Roman Reigns in a backstage segment, they're all talking, they're sitting around chilling within the Bloodline headquarters and then Sammy says that Jay's a hothead and Sammy the Jay starts kicking off and then Roman goes, no, you are a hothead and Sammy, it's your problem. So I think he wants Sammy to manage Jay or something like that. Then we had the Usos walking backstage and they run into the New Day and then it basically turns into a match because obviously it would. Then we had Hit Row coming, coming out where they got beat down by Selena Vega and I think some guy called Fatama, Fatama and Escobar. <laughs> yeah, great. Let's see what happens there. Then we have Shotsky and Raquel versus Sonia and Lee and Raquel and Shotsky win. Then Karrion Cross comes out. I don't know what he was going to do, but he just got jobbed by Drew and it turns into an all-out brawl. Uh, Drew, got, I think, got the worst end of it. Then we had the bloodline, basically. That's Usos and Sammy versus New Day and Braun. Uh, the bloodline, Usos have held the title now for 446 days, which is very long, so they're doing very well. In the end, the new day won uh, due to Sami Zayn and Jay arguing outside. And then in the main event, we had Sheamus versus Gonta uh, in a really tough uh, match. Um, I think it was a, like some type of street fight. I think it was a street fight match. But in the end, Gonta won by using a shillelagh and won the match. So this will lead us nicely into Extreme Rules, which I'll be covering as well. So like subscribe and leave a comment that's raw and smackdown covered in just about six and a half minutes take care